Hi, welcome. My name is H Extraordinary, and this is G Gundam, the Gundam that I was way too young to remember anything from, because I actually do remember watching some episodes from this. The only one that I actually remember is the one where all the Gundams get turned to stone, and then Doman Cashew is a character that can turn into a Super Saiyan. One of the older ones. Oh, Japan, why are you in space? Well then, Tony Stark, they beat you to it. Oh, I saw. Oh, oh. I'm gonna have to stop this. I'm gonna have to dissect some of the stuff in this one because I saw some characters in there that were. Whoa. I remember this man. I don't remember his name though. Why am I dancing so much? Oh, bright, bright, you know, shining finger. See, I know the lyrics. Is that the darkness Gundam? All right, so clearly it's about fighting. I know it's like all oh, different countries fight with their Gundams and whatever. Master Asia, that's his name. I just remembered, Master Asia, the Grand Slam Master of Gundam Wrestling. It's basically Gundam, I don't, martial art Gundam tournaments. So, you know, that's already kind of cool. Mm, Domon Cash, I know one thing, Domon Cashew's brother probably dies and he is the owner of the darkness, the super edgy darkness Gundam. And then there's the Shining Finger, yeah. It's kind of an old anime. I wouldn't. The opening's not. Well, it's alright. It's an older opening. So you know, it's okay. I'm not gonna be like. I'm not gonna be like shining finger. It's not. It's not one of those. Okay, there's one character that I want to talk about. Whenever they decide to show him. Where is he? At? Where is he? At? Where is he? At? Where is he? At? There he is. Is that even a guy? I don't know. So yeah, it looks fine. It has that old school classic Gundam feel. I mean, with the art, but it's more shonen than it would normally be because this is more of a shonen. From what it look, it's I mean, from what I've heard, it's more, more of a shonen one. That's a, it's a beefy Gundam, even though it's not. From what I, from what I saw in the Dynasty Wars Gundam Three game, it's kind of tiny. This one right here. What's going on here? That's... Man, that's rivaling you... <laughs> that's rivaling Yu-Gi-Oh! Zeal levels of a hairstyle. <laughs> What's his name? Yoma? Yeah. I like her. I think I've seen her before. I've never seen this guy before. She's cute. These. They're both cute. Um, bless. Well, this one might be a guy, actually. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know much about this one. Well, I know more than the others, at least. That's the darkness boy, I think. Alright, really, that's that's it. I'm dragging my feet. That's it. Um, it was... If I... Okay, since apparently I guess I'm doing these grades. I don't know why. C plus. C. It's a C. I mean, I'm sure other people like it more than I do, but it's alright. It's an opening. It exists. It's not horrible. It's not amazing. That's okay. People gonna have their opinions. People gonna have opinions. Just because my opinion differs from yours doesn't mean that your opinion is isn't correct. It's an opinion. There's no facts, whatever. You know what I mean. Basically, I'm trying not to get lynched. Oh, that sun in the back's going crazy. 
Dude. So good. Monkey style. I think that's Swarzo? I don't know. I know it starts like that. Oh, I remember that move. Who that? I like her. She has a cute design. Same goes for her. She looks like a Yu-Gi-Oh character. That is an actual Yu-Gi-Oh character. I like his eyebrows. I'll be back on that character. I might have talked a bit too much on this one. Well, you're definitely getting close to the camera. Who's that in her? Ah, is that, is that her own reflection? Ah, look at him, eyeliner, so handsome. And that is just straight up Aqua from Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. Or should I say, wow, Kingdom Hearts ripped off G Gundam. That looks, holy crap. Kingdom Hearts, what did you do? Look at that, that's Aqua. That's, that's just straight up Aqua. Kingdom Hearts, how could you? You just ripped off G Gundam. They look exactly the same. Look, well, the clothes are different. The visuals on this one are a little bit more interesting. If I were to give it a grade, it would still be a C. I mean, it's all right. So it's an all right opening. I mean, for a fighting style anime, you'd think it'd be a little bit more intense, but hey, it's all right. It's all right openings. They're okay. It's a C. The characters seem cool except for that one Yu-Gi-Oh guy. He can, I don't know what he's doing out of his own anime. Where is, what is he doing? What is he doing there? Like I said, the visuals are a little bit more interesting. The music is all right. It's not my thing, but it's not horrible. It's okay. They got a little bit creative with some of the stuff in there, which is cool, I guess. But for an older anime, it's, it's all right. I've heard better, honestly. I'm not gonna lie to you. People can have their opinions, so leave me alone. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I really have to say about it. It's I like the character designs except for that one Yu-Gi-Oh guy, and that's all I have to say about it. I'm gonna go, this is H Extraordinary. If you like the video, make sure to like the video and then subscribe and then click on the notification bell. And then send seven prayers to the to the heavens gate uh seventh linear line art gods that's the fourth step in the youtube process i don't know what i'm talking about anymore but youtube's probably gonna make something like that 